So what's going on my daddy, get it Rose Burnett's, it's me Luigi Kid, and today we're gonna play Dissipated Hat Shock, and not a submission for the Luigi Kid and EXE challenge. As you can see, it's under license of Sega Enterprise. Oh, we're off to a good start my dedicated Rose Burnett's, cause I already see the good looking VHS wipes, the aesthetics are looking just great. Sega, bro that was the loudest Sega screen I've ever heard in my life. Oh, we're playing Sonic the Hedgehog 2. There we go. Made by Tayo. But my dedicated bros, if you don't want your games to get haunted by a blue hedgehog with hyper realistic bloody eyes, make sure to smash the like button. Okay, we're already started. Uh, how am I get up or down? How am I able to jump? I can't even jump at all. Guess I just have to dodge those enemies. I think it's fucking funny that I can pretty much control Tails. Like, get the fuck away, Tails. <laughs> we barely dodged them. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, I guess this shit is scripted. Nothing to be worried about. The cool thing that Tyler said about this game, this was created with Click Team Fusion. That means everything was created from scratch, not like in other Sonic engines. This is actually pretty, pretty good, and I hope that my experience of playing this Sonic game is still similar, like playing an original one. I have zero lives. That makes me a little nervous, not gonna lie. But what is going on? What are we supposed to do? Bro, so close. Sonic doesn't give any damn. damn. Oh, oh, sheesh! What I got here? What is going on? Okay, maybe we can land somewhere here? That's how it feels like with dedicated bro super deaths. Oh, I guess we did it. Wing Fortress Zone. Whoa! Bro! No! We got hit! Tails! Tails is crying. I can't do anything. I can just... Damn. Wait a minute! That shit has to be scripted, right? Yo! What the actual? I... I don't get it. Okay, I... I hope that this is part of the game. I can't explain anything else. If this is not part of the game, I'm low-key fucking fused <laughs> Oh, Tails is still here. I thought for one second that Tails is not appearing. Oh, it looks like Tails has... Smoke some dank weed. Wait, uh, again? <laughs> what? I can't jump for fuck's sake! Oh, I can't jump! I can jump with the control key. Oh. <laughs> Alright. The more you know. This time I know better. I, I still can jump for fuck's sake. Why not? Oh, it's not control, it's the shift button. Fuck! Okay, I gotta have to leave you alone, Tails. I'm sorry. I'm so damn sorry. How could you, Sonic? <laughs> Your best friend. You just left it behind? What the? And the game is frozen. It froze. I, I gotta turn the volume down. It's so freaking loud. <laughs> Biggest oof. <gasps> I knew it. Look, Tails is falling down. You left him to die. How could you, Sonic? You know... Those creepypasta related games are actually my favorites. Like not those where there's Sonic the EXE, but those they make you feel something. And this one makes you feel like a bitch that you are. Holy. Look at that. It's all your fault, Eggman. That my best friend died. Get back here. Oh man, okay. I can't go afterwards. He's like, where's Tails? Don't look at me like that, Sonic. You exactly know what you did. You left your best friend behind. Okay, I can't go this way. I can also spin dash. Alrighty. Then, then we're gonna go into the special zone. Yo, even that looks epic. That looks just like it's like the Hedgehog 2. Okay, get one ring. Bro, and it looks so good. It works so well. But one ring, where's it gonna appear? I'm ready for it. Okay, this is, this is really, really well made. That gets a huge bonus point from my side. Hmm. My dear care, bro, seriously, if you haven't already. We're a good old looking Sonic Creepypasta game. Make sure to smash the like button and don't look behind you. Holy shit. They're fucking hyper realistic knockings. <laughs> no one escapes death. Oh shit. Oh, see, please don't steal. <laughs> 
No one escapes death, especially Tails. This time, there wasn't Tails in the main menu. Oh, and he's also not here appearing. Fuck off, Sonic. What have you done? Oh, it's getting worse and worse. Yo, he's like, wait a minute. Something's wrong. Someone's missing. He's like seeing some shit. Emerald Hill Zone? Where is our boy? Tails. Okay. Seriously? Besides me not being able to spin dash, it just feels like a normal Sonic game. Even though you made it with Click Diffusion, very, very good job. Though when I'm crouching, he's not spinning. There's still room for improvement, but besides that, gameplay-wise, it's pretty, pretty good. There ain't no enemies to worry about. Gucci. Oh, shoot! Shoot! The tornado. And wow. so much fucking blood. Oh, no! Tails! You gotta check his butt. What the fuck? Oh man, that's sad. He barely made it to the goal. He was so close to it. Yo, shut up! <laughs> what have I done? I wasn't able to save Tails. I wasn't able to save it in time. Bro, it's like the solid except this creepy pasta now. The title screen keeps changing. We didn't work with the sprites. Oh yeah, Sonic really sad. Poor fella. Also the music. You know exactly that something is off in your game when the music is not playing the right way. <sighs> but I swear to God, if this game ends with Sonic jumping into spikes or something like that, then I'm a little bit disappointed. You can't just let all these Sonic games end the same way. Sonic getting the big depression and commits the S word. That sometimes gets me demonetized. That's why I'm not saying it. No, don't don't jump into the pit, bro. Yeah, better look up. Is this now the ending of of Sonic the Hedgehog 2? It kind of reminds me of that, to be honest. Can I get a big fat F in chat? An oh, Amen shit. for Tails? Okay, Sonic is just chilling, but he doesn't know that Tails' corpse wasn't even a corpse. Is it Tails' haunted soul? He's coming oh, for no. Sonic's booty. He's taking revenge. Wow. Okay, at least Sonic did jump down. Presented by Sega. Is this is this the end of it? There better be something more. At least one more good jump scare. Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Oh boy. That has actually some very, very great graphics for a Sega Mega Drive game. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! What? There's more! There's fucking more! Okay, Tails, you gotta chill. You gotta calm down. I didn't mean to leave you behind. I had to. I got three times I came over myself. You won't hide from me now. It says, run away. Holy shit, Nuggets. Please don't do this to me. Please don't. Please, no. You won't hide. Oh, everything closed. I don't trust this shit. Oh. <laughs> ah! Holy shit! Oh, wow! That was pretty good! <laughs> thanks for playing- No, thanks for creating it! My eardrums just exploded! That was a pretty, pretty good submission. My heart just skipped 10 fucking beats my dedicated bros and brunettes. That was fucking awesome. And if you, my dedicated bros and brunettes, think so as well, please make sure to smash the like button. In my opinion, the .exe community, ever since I was making those creepypasta challenges or ever since the Friday Funkin' vs. Sonic.exe mode came out, it goes stronger than ever. And I'm super happy that so many dedicated bros and brunettes out there participating in the Luigi.exe challenge. So if you want to submit your self-made game for the Luigi.exe challenge as well, please join my Discord server at discord.gg slash Luigi.kit and submit them in the show chat for a chance to get up to $1,000 and a huge Elgato streamer slash let's play a package. With all that being said, my dedicated bros and that's once again, please make sure to smash the like button and subscribe to my channel because you're getting closer and closer to 800,000 subscribers and you son of a bitch can actually make a difference. So let's fucking go. Help me please to have a confusing algorithm, okay? With all that being said, don't forget to subscribe to join the Plumberhood if you haven't already, to rate the video or to leave a comment to give me some feedback and we see each other in the next video. So let's my dedicated bros and that's the awesome stay safe and see you ciao